Toy Collector here. Today I went to Best Buy um, just to pick up the exclusive steel books that they've got. Um, many of you may have seen this back in May where they originally had the steel books. So I'm going to show you what I've got. These are these are the ones I picked up today that I'm adding to my steel book collection. I've got Superman Returns. and The Departed. So these are the two new Best Buy exclusives. They have these little stickers on it. So Superman Returns and The Departed. And I also picked up back in May, these are the original. I got 300. I've got Batman Begins. and the dark knight I got the book of Eli good fellas green lantern this is the blu-ray size it's not the DVD size like Best Buy had out originally when, when Green Lantern came out originally, Best Buy had the DVD size of Green Lantern, so this is the Blu-ray size. They, they're all the same size now. I got The Hangover. These right here were very hard to find back in May. Hangover Part 2. I wasn't able to find these back in May, so I picked these up today. Gran Torino Inception The Last Samurai I've got The Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring The, the Two Towers and the return of the king I picked up the matrix Shawshank Redemption Sucker Punch and V for Vendetta Okay, um, another part of the set is Sherlock Holmes. So this right here came out back in May with the other um, Blu-ray still books. And right after this came out, um, they put out the Sherlock Holmes A Game of Shadows still book exclusive. I don't know that I don't know that you can find these now um, with the sale that's going on at Best Buy today. Same way with Clash of the Titans. Clash of the Titans came out in May on Steelbook for Best Buy exclusive. And then right after that, they released Wrath of the Titans 3D with a Steelbook. And if I'm not mistaken, today I saw Wrath of the Titans for $9.99. It's not the 3D version. I think the casing looks the same, but of course it doesn't have the 3D. Now all of these have got a a matte finish. They're not glossy or anything. They're they're really good. They don't leave your fingerprints on them. Very nice still book. And you know, whenever I purchased these, I went ahead. There's no inside artwork on them, so I took the backing from the back of the um, packaging, the cardboard backing, and put those on the inside of all the ones that I opened up. So I opened all mine and put the backing on the inside. Just like with Green Lantern. And just put the backing on the inside. That gives it some that that gives you a place to put the backing instead of just throwing it out. So that way you'll know what the special features are in a description of the movie. So I think that's a pretty good idea. Um, anyways, tell me what you think about my um still books. Thanks for watching.